Hello, and welcome to today's video in our five minute farm doc series. I'm Nick Paulson from the University of Illinois, and today I'll be summarizing a recent analysis of the supplemental coverage option and enhanced coverage option crop insurance programs in Illinois. These supplemental programs, known as SCO and ECO, provide farmers a way to cover a portion of their crop insurance deductible range. But how often have these programs actually triggered payments in Illinois counties over the past eight years? That's what we examined in two central Illinois counties, Pyatt and Knox. The major factor in triggering SCO and ECO payments has been county yields falling below the guarantee yield levels. Price declines during the insurance period have generally not been large enough alone to trigger payments. For example, Pyatt County hasn't had any SCO or ECO payments since 2015 because actual yields have been above the guarantee every year. But in Knox County, ECO payments would have triggered three out of the past eight years when yields dropped below the guarantee levels. The takeaway is that SCO and ECO may provide additional risk protection, but they haven't performed as expected over the past eight years in many Illinois counties. Farmers should carefully weigh the extra premium costs, which can be substantial, against the additional coverage they receive and the likelihood of payments being triggered in their county when considering these supplemental products. As always, stay tuned to FarmDoc Daily for the latest analysis and insights on issues impacting your farm. Let us know in the comments if you have any questions.